Hello, my name is Rachel and welcome to my channel. It's lovely to have you here. Today we're going to do a very special video. This is going to be just on Pilates breathing. So I'm going to give you a little tutorial and then we're going to do five minutes just on the breathing. So you can do this lying down, standing up, sitting in a chair. I'm going to do it sitting in a chair with you. All right, so just a little reminder, do subscribe if you can by pressing here and don't forget to press the bell as well. That's the notification button and that will just remind you whenever I've uploaded a new video. All right, so go ahead, get yourselves ready and I'll see you in a moment. Okay, so let's start with a tutorial. This is probably the question I get asked the most is about how to do Pilates breathing. So I'm gonna give you this tutorial, then we're gonna do the breathing. So I'm gonna do it in a chair. If you wanna do it in a chair, please feel free to join me. If not, you can do it standing or you can do it lying down. So first thing is get yourself into a neutral position. So whether you're lying, standing, sitting in a chair, I want you to feel that you are active in your body. So you're going to be sitting up or standing up, all right, or lengthening through the spine. I'm going to have those shoulders nice and relaxed. Lengthen through the back of your neck. And the first thing we're going to do is put the hands on the bottom of our ribs. So find the bottom of your rib cage and have your hands just holding there. And the idea is that we're trying to feel the ribs. So I want you to apply a little bit of pressure so you can feel those ribs, okay? We're going to do the inhale first. So in Pilates, we inhale through the nose and at the same time, we're trying to expand our ribs out to the side. So here we go, inhaling. And then as you exhale, you're gonna try and bring those ribs back towards each other, but without allowing the body to sink, okay? So we are still lifting through that spine, lengthening through that spine. So you're inhaling, expanding the ribs, and as you exhale, you're gonna bring those ribs back together. So let me show you, inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. One more, inhale. Exhale. All right, so don't be worried if you get a little bit lightheaded. That can happen when you first start to do this deep breathing technique, okay? So second part of this is the exhale. So for that, I'd like you to bring your hands down, find your belly button, and you want your hands just below, so like an inch or a couple of centimeters below the belly button. And again, you're sitting up nice and tall, okay? You're standing nice and tall, hands resting there. Okay, so you're going to take your breath in and on your breath out, I want you to pull your tummy inwards. So your whole abdominal wall is pulling inwards towards your spine. Okay, so I'm going to take my hands away so you can see. You're going to breathe in. Breathe out, pulling that abdominal wall in. Inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. And again, deep breath in. Exhale through the mouth. Okay, so now we're going to pull all that together, inhaling through the nose, expanding the ribs. Exhaling through the mouth, drawing the abdominals in. Inhaling. 
inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. One more time, inhale. And exhale. Okay, so that is your tutorial on how the breathing works. Now let's put it into practice. Why not click here and go straight to our five minutes of guided breathing. If you'd like to support me and this channel, then you can buy me a virtual cup of coffee on Ko-fi. See all the details down below in the description box.